All right, I did not title this video too well. I should have done it, uh, but I will change it afterwards. Kind of a, an amazing happening. Maybe somebody here can update me about what today's date is. I have not been writing it on any of the videos today yet, but I will follow up a little bit later once I do that. Good evening, good morning to whenever you're watching this, wherever you're watching from. We're still in the first week of May and we have uh, an amazing uh, happening here tonight. Uh, the amazing thing is I am broadcasting from the main gate at the SpaceX launch site. Let me zoom out a little bit. I'm going to zoom out as much as I can. This will be for the history books. This is the first night when the main gate here was back open after the launch of the integrated Starship 24 on April 20th, 2023. So we're in that first week of May. And today might be a Tuesday. I believe it might be a Tuesday. Otherwise, it's a Wednesday. I think today is a Tuesday, but the main gate is open this morning. This road here had all these types of white cones on it all the way down the road, and it was blocked off for like the last week or so since the launch, so since April 20th, so over 10 days, and maybe more like 12 days if today's the second or the third, I'm not sure what today is, May 3rd or 2nd. Uh, but uh, just tonight, they opened it up, they took all the cones off the road here, and finally, after maybe 12 or 13 days after the launch, we have, uh, we can get some shots here. The, the gate is open. They have a generator on that light over there. This is the annoying light that we used to see all the time. And so this is the first night that I had that light on. And uh, pretty interesting. So we're gonna get to see some new stuff happening uh, because they have the gate open and we're allowed to park here. And uh, so maybe we'll start seeing some starships or something come down the road in the next uh, couple days three, four days. Maybe by Friday or s Saturday, maybe we could see some type of ship or something down here. I could see something like that happening. Looks like they did, uh, the, it looks pretty organized inside. I don't see much debris over there, uh, but uh, we'll see, see what you guys think as well. All right. Grant, hi. Hey. 10.35 in the evening, good stuff. I'm not sure what today is, the 2nd or the 3rd of May, but uh, they, they have opened the gate here, and uh, we've been live streaming from all the way over there to the east on the dunes. And uh, t again, tonight is the first night where they've taken these cones off the road and they opened it up for people to park along the side of the road here. Hey Chris, it's going, yeah, it's going good, going good. I still have a runny nose. But, uh, so I'm looking forward to the time when, uh, probably uh, maybe not too, not too much later, we'll start seeing this parking lot get filled up with workers' cars and things like that. Yeah, it's been good footage, thanks Chris. I went back and I added some nicer audio to some of the videos from today. And I've kind of been doing that. I've been uh, kind of posting the videos unedited and raw, and then uh, going back toward the end of the day and adding some nice audio. So if you think some of the, I, I do listen to some of the commentary about whether a certain music is good or bad, or it'd be nice if there wasn't so much wind. So I do listen to that. And uh, today I went back and added some nice music to a few of the tracks there. probably do it about another five minutes and I'll round it up at 10 at 10 minutes total hey Grant thanks for all your help today too Grant uh, it was real nice and uh, yesterday as well I appreciate that and it does make the the big difference uh, makes a difference here so
above and beyond. So the tower still has these white lights on it. We don't see any yellow or any green or red lights on the tower yet. Um, so these haven't changed since the launch on the 20th. But tonight we see that it is open. The main gate is open. Open for business. Yeah, Chris. Yep. Looks like there's some type of ratcheting going on at pad A on the right over here is um, so they're starting to do some work over in this area sorry I guess if you have a um, some of the La Padre and the NSF people and other people, if you have the hoop cam, you can probably get out here again with your different rovers and cameras and set them up again now that the road is open or, or move them back into the positions that you like to use them. So that's something for, for those people. Maybe let them know the road is open. Let's see what they're doing. Yeah, some kind of preparation at Pad A. Hey, Sir Chris. Earlier this morning when I saw, when I left the site, I didn't see any cars in here. So this is all new. Uh, people driving around on the launch pad, you know, in this, in the, on this launch site. This is uh, new. It wasn't happening this morning. So can someone tell me if today is May 2nd or 3rd? That is one of my main questions for tonight. Today's date is, if you live in the United States, what is it? May 2nd. Good stuff. Thank you, Sir Chris. And Chris, awesome. So today being May 2nd of 2023, 2020. So it's 12 days since the launch. All right, so this is gonna be the last minute of the show. Um, it was just a quick uh, kind of a The time now is 10.42 in the evening. Yeah, it's exciting, Chris. Yep. And uh, again, the, the update was that they opened the gate here and uh, allowed us to park along the side of the road. Also check out some of the videos that were uploaded earlier in the early afternoon. And uh, I did add some music to some of them. All right, in the last 25 seconds, thank you for watching. Thanks for tuning in. This is a, each video possibly is an adventure or an opportunity to do something here on the site. That's why I've been titling them uh, recently the way I have. Be well, and I will see you on the other side.